One of my top 10 shows of all time is The Walking Dead, and I've been watching it from the beginning. I grew up watching the show. Being such a big fan and a sucker for a good zombie game, I just had to make a video when the announcement trailer dropped for this new title, The Walking Dead Destinies, and it is not looking great so far. The concept is what has my attention right now. The game is a third-person narrative-driven uh, action-adventure game in which your choices can reshape the TV show stories from seasons 1 through 4. Really cool concept, it adds that what-if scenario. What they showed in the trailer is the first thing that came to my mind, was the moment when Rick kills Shane, but what if Shane kills Rick, where they both walk away and the herd that hears the gunshot never comes. This is also where the game could be limited, because if you change the story too dramatically, it could get out of hand. They are going to need to invest in branching paths for even other character deaths like Dale or T-Dog if you want to keep them alive longer. Also, if some character deaths don't happen at all, how does that affect other characters? Like, if Amy doesn't die in Season 1, will Andrea attempt to opt out at the CDC? And you can go on and on with these scenarios for quite some time, so where do the devs draw the line? I know this is just an announcement trailer, but the gameplay itself looks really rough. They didn't show a lot, it's mostly like small snippets, but visually it's it's okay. It's not amazing, it doesn't look fantastic or up to, I guess you'd say, the modern standard. I'm also not sure how the game would play. They said there's going to be third person action and some resource management, so this isn't going to be like a telltale experience where you interact with some things, do some QTEs, and make dialogue choices. We did learn that Flux Games is developing the game, and Game Mill Entertainment will publish this title. It's going to be on all major platforms. It'll also be priced at 50 USD. I'm not sure at all about this game. I have no high expectations at all. I feel like my low expectations come from the last few Walking Dead games that haven't been that great, except for Saints and Sinners. That was a really good VR title but we'll have to wait and see.